Greetings, greetings to everyone who's watching me from different parts of the world. I have another word of direction to somebody who's watching me right now. And to some, this is a word of encouragement. Brothers and sisters, the word is, this person is not what you think he is. They are pretending. They are put on a mask of disguise. Some of you, the people who are around you, are trying to pretend to like you. Just because they want to get something out of you. Remember, I have already spoken about this. That there is a gift in you. There is something deposited in the inside of you that the enemy is after. You may think that they are after uh, helping you. And yet, their main motive is to kill what is in you. And after they have killed, they will run away. Doesn't the scripture say that the enemy only comes to kill, steal, and destroy? He wants to kill what belongs to you. His main motive is to steal and destroy. So be very careful. Because there are many people around you who you have no idea of who they are. You may think that you really know them. Some of them may even be your family. Some of them, you, you may have grown up with them, and yet they are the same people responsible for your predicament. So be very careful, my brothers and sisters, not to trust anyone. Because there are people who, you, when you give important information about you, they will use it against you. Brothers and sisters, as you go to work this morning, be very careful. As you come back from work, be very careful. Because there are people who are watching you. They are watching every step that you make. They even know where you stay. They even know what you ate for dinner. They even know what you eat for breakfast. So be very careful. I'm not saying that this that you should so that you may become scared, that you may become afraid. No. I'm saying this so that you may be very careful. Remember, fear is not from God, fear is from the devil. So these are words of encouragement to encourage you to be on guard. Be like a watchman. Watch and pray. Don't slumber. Do not allow the spirit of slumber to take over you. Brothers and sisters, this is the word I have for you. Until next time, God bless you.